home prices are near the highest they have been in the past decade, which means if you are house hunting, keeping things affordable is very difficult to do. But Consumer Report says take care not to get in over your head and has some suggestions to help you avoid the debt trap. Here's Josh Spryder. Lizeth Morales knows what she wants in a house. If money was no object, I would have a four bedroom, <laughs> three and a half bathroom, huge walk in closet. These are solid hardwood floors. Most home buyers have a long list of what they want, but Consumer Reports cautions against buying a home that's more expensive than you can comfortably afford. In a recent survey of home buyers, one third said they ended up spending more than they expected to, and nearly a third put down a higher down payment than they anticipated when they made the purchase. The general rule in spending on housing is you only want to spend about a quarter of your take home pay. That's so you have money left over for other goals, for example, saving for retirement or paying for education. Toby Stanger of Consumer Reports says to avoid overextending yourself, start by putting 20% down. It not only means you're going to have a lower mortgage, it also helps you avoid private mortgage insurance. That's a lot of money to save. Also, be sure to put money aside for improvements, repairs, or unexpected budget busters. So you have cash on hand, a lower monthly nut, that puts you in a better position to weather a financial rough patch. As Lizeth knows, home ownership can add many things to your life. Don't let financial stress be one of them. With this Consumer Reports, I'm Josh Breider, News 3 Now. Some mortgage bankers use a different way to determine what you can afford, which may lead them to suggest you take on a larger mortgage. Well, but Consumer Reports cautions that just because you're approved for a lar larger mortgage doesn't mean you should be taking all of it. And Josh is continuing to look into affordability concerns in the Madison market. If you have any other story ideas, let him know by contacting him on his social media pages or send him an email.